Hi guys, today we're gonna to react to Boku Dake Cinderella, which means my own Cinderella, by Gacharik Spin. This is a buy me a coffee request from JM. Thank you, JM, for this Gacharik Spin request. It's been a little while since we reacted to them. We love them. Thank you. Yes, uh, thank you, JM. We appreciate the ongoing support. Always awesome to see Gacharik Spin. So yeah, let's get to it. えー、ゲストプレイヤーがお祝いにこけつけてくれてます。TSP。ひな。ひなちゃん。セクシーな。セクシーなドラマ。セクシー。すごいよ。あの、あの、ひなちゃんとはね、ま、台湾だったりとか
Hannah has a deeper voice. So the experience of a guitar experience song led by Hannah is slightly different than one led by Angie. Angie, I think, has a more mischievous texture in it. And both voices are awesome, but it's a slightly different signature. And I love it about the way Hannah sings. Also, when Tomozo started a solo, I thought this is Tomozo attacking now. We all needed a little bit of dose of Tomozo. I just love her solos. And uh, yeah, so far it's uh, awesome. It's a very uplifting song. As our uh, regular viewers might know, uh, I love Hannah in every which way possible, whether she's on drums, on guitar, singing. I just love everything about her. She's awesome. The rest of the girls, like you said, the Tomozo uh, solo was fantastic she's always awesome and i love watching that and the energy that koga and ori oriana bring to the table is always awesome to watch and i noticed that uh, hina the guest drummer was actually bringing that kind of energy she was definitely in there and yeah. giving it her all and she's pretty freaking awesome <laughs> Guitar Experience, always fantastic. And this is another one of those high energy live performances that we've come to know and love from them. We've always said that they throw a lot of everything into the mix and it always works. In this one, I felt that it was a little bit more contained, not as much a, a crazy nuclear storm as, as some of them have been in the past. And I, I really enjoyed that. They always sound funky. There's something to their sound that just like they bring the funk. This is an uplifting song and the subject matter is uplifting, but it feels like the narrator is talking to a person who needs uplifting, talking to a person who's, uh, who's a bit down. It can go in many different directions. There are words of empowerment, to a Cinderella, somebody, some, somebody who came from rags to riches. But I still can't point out if the narrator is pep talking themselves or if they're addressing it to a loved one or possibly a, a, a mother talking to a daughter. So there are a few lines there that had me thinking in those directions. My own cute Cinderella, I want to be next to you, protect you at all times. I can't sing without you. I'll send you my love. I hope it it reaches you, baby. I love you, only you. Okay, to me, it just sounds like it's actually from one lover to another, basically reassuring them of their love. It was mm -hmm. uh, some created distance for whatever reason. And one lover is saying to the other, don't worry, I still love you. You're the only one for me kind of thing from a distance. I'll, I'll, I'll be back sending you my love from here. The reason that I didn't think it had anything to do with parents is because there's uh, some sexual references in here. There was one section that said, when you made our heartbeats and breaths intertwine, we embraced the rhythm and kept on. It sounded to me like it's a little bit more in that direction. And then it referred to a stolen climax in the middle of the night. So heart pounding, tongue stuck out with more of a clatter. I thought that that was a, a sort of a sexual reference. Uh, I'm not 100% sure that it is. Again, we have to remind that these are translated lyrics. So yeah. we're going by sort of what's in front of us. Yeah. But to me, that's what it felt like a person talking to their own cute Cinderella because not so much a rags to riches, but someone who they think of as their own princess, someone that they put on a pedestal, someone so beautiful, you know, that they can't do without. They're saying, I can't sing without you. It was a 
line that says, because this is my final love, never, never, never ending love. Basically saying, you're the one for me, you're the last one I'll ever be, be with, kind of uh, sent me off in, in that direction, yeah. that this is between two lovers, one reassuring the other. And uh, yeah, it was a pretty, you know, cool way of putting it and an awesome sounding song as well. The girls are just fantastic. Despite the discrepancies in the translated uh, lyrics that we can't really uh, derive precise things from it, the, the name itself, uh, yeah, uh, strengthens your opinion on it because it's it's a Cinderella situation, so it's a romantic love situation. I think there's uh, something in that. And there was a, a spot there where it, it says, um, "I can't dance without you. Um, never, I won't let you go anytime. I love you. I'll sing more for my own Cinderella. Don't cry. Look, chin up." So again, like you said, it's it's a pick me up. It's uh, reassuring them. It, everything's okay. I'll be back. Just hold on because uh, everything is okay. There's no meaning without you was one of the lines so okay. yeah yeah no very cool kind of a romantic song really yeah. enjoyed it yeah so once again thank you jm for another awesome request we are enjoying all the ones you're sending our way all fantastic and uh yeah we appreciate the ongoing support keep it coming yeah thanks jam for this guitar spin request uh we enjoyed every second of it please more of this if you enjoyed this episode guys please be sure to like subscribe comment and click the little bell icon so you get notified on all our future videos if you have a request you'd like bumped up the line please make it through buy me a coffee all contributions are of course very much appreciated thank you all for sticking with us Thank you all for your time. As always, right about now, our Gacharic Spin playlist should be coming up on the screen somewhere around here. Just, uh, yeah, give it a click. Check it out. There's some awesome stuff in there. Let us know what you think. We hope you enjoy it. We'll be back in a couple of days with a new episode. We hope to see you all then. Thanks again, guys. See you soon. Bye, Bye guys.